Okay, welcome to this video. How is the um, fully buttoned up to your collar look? <laughs> Just kidding. So, okay, in this video, guys, I'm going to share with you how um, to practice syncopation um, using semi quavers. And why is syncopation important? Um, well, first, uh, when you practice syncopation uh, and you try to um, perform or play the accents on your left hand, your, your non-master hand, it improves um, independence, uh, it makes your left hand or your non-master hand more active in playing, it um, makes your playing your hands a little more equal in, the, in terms of uh, playability, in terms of uh, independence, in terms of um, uh, soloing, I'll explain later what I mean by that. So basically, syncopation is a great exercise, a, a wonderful thing to do to um, improve uh, the skill level of your non-master hand, to put it very simply. Okay? So um, I'll show you a syncopation, syncopation, syncopation practice that I do um, um, not really on a regular basis, but when I do it, when I do do it, I do this when it comes to semi quavers. And of course, there are other types or other methods of uh, syncopation practice. You can do it with uh, 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 sextuplets, triplets, or other ways of uh, doing putting it putting it into a groove and then accenting at different parts of the uh, bar. Okay. So for this video, I'm just going to show you how to do a simple syncopation practice for in using semi quavers cool so there are 16 semi quavers in a bar right so um let's divide them into four now so one e and a two e and a three e and a four e and a what you first do is you accent on the one so one e and a, two e and a, three e and a, four e and a. the first of every group of four and then you accent on the second one. So one, E and a two, E and a three, E and a four, E and a. And then you accent on the third beat of every four or third stroke. So one, E and a two, E and a three, E and a four, E and a. And finally, the fourth one. Uh, one, E and a two, E and a three, E and a four, E and a. Okay, so you do this practice um, and I'll show it to you how it's done. I'm going to set the metronome to 105 BPM. There we go. So here's how it sounds. got that um, let me go slower okay all right so that's 80 two three four okay um, let's go faster now. Okay, let's go 160 now. So what I'm showing you is basically how to practice this in the slower tempos and when you get better in the quicker tempos. So 160. So there you have it, the um, syncopation practice using semi quavers. Um, have fun with it and uh, keep rocking. 
the reason why syncopation is so uh, important is because uh, it allows you to um, um, uh, play fillers that are that have accents on the upbeat instead of the regular downbeat. It makes the left hand more versatile, more uh, empowered, uh, um, much more uh, capable. Uh, your non-master hand, I mean. Uh, so, um, when you're playing a groove as well, or when you're doing fillers, if your syncopation is good, you can accent on the uncommon um, spots or, or points in the bar. If you know what I mean. So let me show you an example. Um, I'll play something in. Uh, let me see. This is let's say one four five BPM. Okay. Yeah. Stuff like that.